So feet and momentum. Get those feet nice and close, and I'm going to talk. To, I'll talk you through the exercise, what I'm what I'm doing with each foot or, or, or feet, feet together. I'm going to keep my hand pointed forward, just like I talk about in my cut. You know, my, my focus point isn't the cow's eye here, it's where I'm going. So my, my hands are going to give my horse direct, um, my hands are going to give my horse direction and my feet are going to ride them in the direction that I want to go. So, so we're going to do two feet here to go straight through this. All we're going to do is just kind of figure out our way through. So I need, now it's right foot, two feet, right foot, right foot, two feet. Now it's left foot, left foot, left foot, two feet, left foot, two feet. Right foot, he went a bit wide there, and outside rein, two feet, left foot, right foot, two feet, left foot all the way around. So he's, he's gone a bit wide, and he's sort of hanging up in my left foot, see? Now two feet, right foot, two feet, left foot, right foot, left foot. So he's not quite as good back to the the right as he is to the to the left, right foot. So ultimately, how I kind of this idea about the, doing this with the kids was it, it's incorporating hopefully a similar feel. Like when you're coming through the herd, it's never just r driving forward in a, in a straight line. You, you know, you have to to feel the cow and, and and stay with that control spot. So that cow does very rarely does that cow just walk in a perfect line away from you, it's it's typically trying to go back to the herd, so you have to 